What's going on guys? We're doing something a little different today. We're gonna to be reviewing recent drama as in July 4th, 2023. Alleged star, alleged cuck, alleged predator named Adam22 is uh, letting his wife of like three weeks ago smash some other dudes, right? A lot of people were reacting to it, so I was like, let's hop on it. Let's see what it's about. And here I am. First, I'm gonna watch the TikTok that uh, her his wife, Lena the Plug, has a huge announcement. Let's go ahead and watch this. Hey guys, guess who I'm shooting with today? We're off the rip. She's kind of a baddie. Should I say that? Should I say that about this guy's wife? Nah. Especially when she's about to get fucked. <laughs> she's about to get fucked. <laughs> It's finally happening. Wow, I did not know you were going to do that. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Can you imagine just sitting at home, you're enjoying your coffee, and you know your wife. <laughs> your wife just said to you, hey, so I met up with Chris today when we uh, shot our little business. The business ain't even just like chilling or, you know, discussing a meeting. It's him shoving his dick inside her. But anyway, that's besides the point. If that's your husband and wife dynamic, go for it, I guess. Whatever works for you. It doesn't work for me, but whatever works for you. If you're, if you're happy, that's what matters, right? Well, let's go ahead and watch these interviews that I have set up. He has a lot to say on the subject, and so do his friends. I just want to break it to you guys so that you guys all know what's going on. <laughs> After seven years together, we've been doing porn pretty much the whole time, but we've gotten more and more deeper into the conversation or into the, the porn stuff. And mm -hmm. after, you know, many hundreds and hundreds of threesomes and stuff, yeah, I decided, well, we decided, we've been having this conversation for like damn near a year. Get to the point, brother. Rip it off like a band-aid. Go ahead. I know you want to let us know. She shot her first ever scene without you. with another man oh, over the weekend. That shows growth. Growth? <laughs> I'm gonna leave my bias out of this. But uh, whatever works for him, you know? This is not something I'd be like, hey, so just so you know, my wife fucked other men. You know what I mean? I would keep it to myself personally. Well, personally, I wouldn't even let it happen. But if I was in a situation where this had to happen, I would, I would take that shit to the grave. But I mean, she's kind of famous. So it's kind of hard to do that. That shows, yes. bro, but they get on your ass saying that you you don't have it in, in you to disagree with me. So I'm going to use this as an example. Tell me how you really feel. What about her? Do Listen, <laughs> for the money, you don't want to hear what I'm talking about for the money, young. I, I'm going to tell it for the money, young. Yeah. I, I disagree. I could disagree with Adam if he told a lie. Like, you, you try to stay away from bullshit on the podcast. Mm. It's like, all right, how I really feel is that I need my girl to go out and shoot a motherfucking porno solo scene so she can bring that bag back home. As a porn star, it is your job. However, this is my wife we're talking about, bro. <laughs> this is my wife. Personally, I don't share, honestly. Like I said, whatever works for your dynamic and whatever makes you happy, that's good and all. But me, uh, especially my new wife, we don't even married like two weeks. <laughs> hey, you wanna go ahead? God, I don't know. I don't know. Let's continue. The reality is, is that her career has been, you know, helped by me for sure, but also held back by me to a certain extent because of the fact that we would only shoot together. My issue here is that you guys are already pretty successful. What further career enhancement are you talking about? If you ask me, there was no reason to do so. <laughs> I mean, you guys have been talking about it for a year. Maybe she wanted that. I don't know. It doesn't seem that way. I'm curious as to what was the thought process. Cause you guys already make millions. You guys already make millions. So <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what was the purpose. The yeah, number one true. thing that she gets asked, that she gets requested, whatever, is they want to see her shoot with another guy. Man, fuck them fans, bro. <laughs> bro, that's my girl. You guys are the ones with your dick in your hands. All right. <laughs> this is my girl we're talking about. All right. <laughs> hey, who cares? What I would have done personally, as I would just kept that train going as much as it could. From my perspective, I'm not gonna let my wife fuck another dude. In her defense, apparently they've been doing threesomes for a long time. You gotta give and take somewhere. But still, like, who cares what the fans want? When it's something serious or sacred, or something like that, well, they're, they're porn stars, so 
I'm not a porn star, so it is hard for me to fill their shoes, you know what I mean? But going from my perspective, this is my wife, you know? This is not their wife. I don't care if they want to see her shoot with another dude, you know? You're lucky you even get to see my wife in the beginning! <laughs> You know, we've kind of had the conversation over the years and, and I started to come to this realization that the reason why I didn't want her to do it was not because of my own personal jealousy. Questionable, because you're out here talking about it. That speaks volumes already. It was really just the fact that I didn't want to be the guy who got roasted on the internet that week. Well, <laughs> that age like spoiled milk. <laughs> Dude, oh man. That age is really bad. I'm sure you already know, but I got some news for you, brother. You're the guy who rests on the internet for the week. Maybe even the next week. You know, I didn't want to be the one that everybody yeah, was making feedback. videos about, whatever. And I slowly started to feel like that's kind of a stupid reason. <coughs> making videos? Who's making videos about you, bro? <coughs> I'm not, definitely not me. for me to hold her back from doing something that would realistically be very, very good for her career, you know? You guys already make millions! You guys already make millions, bro! Me, I'm a firm believer, money is a necessity for life. There's no getting around that, right? But you can be so rich to the point where money becomes meaningless. I don't know if that makes sense. Once you get to the point where like every all your needs are covered, you're living a good life, what does more money benefit you for? You know what I mean? Once you reach that pinnacle, what's the point of earning more and more and more? I don't know, maybe because I haven't reached that pinnacle that I don't know what it's truly like. To me, there's more to life than just money. Okay, here's the second interview. So I've been with my girl for mm -hmm. seven years. We just got married. Mm -hmm. We're not in an open relationship. You are now. She doesn't belong to you, she belongs to the fans. But some people will be like, well, I'm going home to the girl. Well, that's cool, you know, that's cool. She filmed her first ever scene with another man. I know you was mad. Oh, shit. You was I mean, angry. I, I agreed to it, so I wasn't. But, I, would, but, I say but, angry but, might not be the word. But you was kind of like disappointed a little bit. Like, you five, like, cut, like, cut, that's your sitch. You know, I agreed to it. She gave me a lot of outs on the way in. Like, yeah. she kind of kept telling me, like, if you don't want me to, I won't do it. You, you should know? have said no. <laughs> I mean, he has a point. I mean, he has a point. You didn't deny or confirm. He was like, hey. I know you mad. <laughs> I know you upset. You disappointed. And you, you're just like, no, well, I, I, I allowed it. No, 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 bro. And you see it on your face. What's done is done, I guess. I said that I wanted you her to do it. I'm like, on top of millions of dollars, Adam. You didn't have to do that shit. Finish. Wow. <laughs> hey, I said the same thing, bro. Millions on top of millions of dollars. You like, you didn't gotta do that. If we already made it, why the fuck are we trying to get more? But that's just me. You're at the finish line. Why are you trying to run the race again? <laughs> God. But I, I told on, her, uh, I'm like, I think you should do it. Let's let's get it out right, the way. So let's go ahead and do it. <laughs> you don't have to. You didn't have to. Bro, who cares what them fans want? They're the ones with their dicks in their hands. Bro. <laughs> Listen, with the small fan base I do have, you know, I appreciate them, right? But if they're gonna ask you to do something I don't wanna do, I ain't gonna do it, I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm about to be like, well, you guys can shoot the scene for me, how about that? <laughs> Sorry. You felt like you needed to do it, so how do you know the grass isn't always greener if you don't go over the fence? That ain't the fence I would've crossed, but to each their own. I was kind of surprised because I feel like I can like intellectualize it, and okay. from my perspective, I don't think it should be a big deal. Yeah. But then after she actually did it, I'm not going to lie, I did feel kind of odd. Well, I don't know why you felt odd. It's because your throne room was raided, bro. <laughs> That's why. It got not even just raided, it got straight up desecrated. You know that dude has got like a 12 inch cock, dude. Fucking, you know that shit's got like freaking horse action going on. Man, I wouldn't be in this situation. But let's just say, for example, let's just say, for example, my, uh, my significant other broke a boundary, right? And went over there and did it anyway. She did her part. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna part ways! Bro, right? ain't no way! Ain't no way, <laughs> dude! Oh, it couldn't be me. Like I said in the beginning of the video, people have their own dynamics, you know what I mean? Some people are okay, completely okay. And you sleep soundly at night. Honest to God, I don't know if I could just... Oh, imagine watching the video. Oh. 
Oh, imagine watching the video. Just, you just sitting there watching. <laughs> Harder than anything that you could do. Oh! <laughs> hey, man. Hey, whatever, bro. You even said it yourself. You're a little bothered by it. Hey, it's in 4K on record. You said yourself you're a little bothered by it. So that's tough, brother. You know, a little bit of that like feeling in, in the belly, See, you know? Was, like, God was, God was, like, for real? Yeah. God, like, oh, God damn, like, <laughs> Yo, I ain't gonna lie, you better keep that dude in the back around. I know it's funny because in the first interview, they were like, oh, he's not gonna turn down whatever you were saying. And he was just like, oh, go get that back. But this guy right here is like, man, what the fuck are you doing, bro? <laughs> uh, that's funny. Anyways, guys, that's the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Final thoughts, I will say, good for him, but also tough. You know, hey, it was under your discretion. You can't even really say it was behind your back, you know, or anything. It's not my dynamic, it's your dynamic. Hope things work out for you, man. Hey, see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.